Hey, brothers and sisters. Today, I thought I'd share something that has been an essential tool in my studies and helping me write better memos. So I'm gonna start with the blue book. This is the blue book, a uniform system of citation. Now, the reason why this book is used is because it makes it easier for everyone to understand a standardized format of writing. So there's not different formats. So this is the standard that's used in courts. So as you can see here, you have the introduction. It talks about basic legal citation, court documents, jurisdiction specific citation rules and style guides and so much more. It pretty much runs the gamut of everything you need to know for writing. So just to um, to start here, we have uh, the quick reference footnotes, um, how to cite a book, rule 15, periodical materials, interviews. Let's see. Look, they have online free trials here, and here's the access code. Um, I don't really use that, but just browsing through here, the first um, area talks about court and litigation documents, and I be believe that's the most important because it's in blue and it's in the beginning, so I always take it more seriously there. So. This is how you would cite a newspaper article, for example, if it's written by um, Abigail Sullivan Moore. Uh, it looks like the name is written pretty much from first, middle, and last name. Then there's the title underlined, followed by the media outlet or the newspaper that it was published in, the date, and the section. So that's how you quote articles that are in your favor that you see in a newspaper in a court and litigation document. So, um, they have all the different names for the different courts. These are the, di the district courts when you're citing them. And I, and I used to wonder, how do I cite these different cases? And I would never know how to really cite them properly, but once I got this book, I could just pretty much go in to find out exactly how to do that so that's the blue book and i will share another book with you on the next video thank you so much